Hi everybody, it's Brandon from Loop Press and uh, here today with another instructional video on how to disassemble and reassemble a weapon. Today we are working with a Ruger Security 9. This is one of their newer models uh, from Ruger, manufactured out of Prescott, Arizona. Uh, this is in 9mm and um, as you can see a uh, little bit larger than some of the other uh, 9mm Rugers out there. It's a little bulkier, but it has a very, very good feel to it. We'll go ahead and uh, show you a little bit about the weapon real quick. This is your safety back here. This safety is engaged, okay? And then you have your slide catch, your takedown pin, and your magazine release. We'll go ahead and release that magazine. This here is a 9-round magazine. It has the extender uh, for the grip. So you got your pinky there on it and uh, gives you a little bit better grip. And uh, again, this is in nine millimeter. We'll sit this little guy right over here for right now. And uh, we'll go ahead and take this safety off so we can rack that to the rear and clear the weapon. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and engage that slide catch, which is right there. So we can unload and show clear, you know, right there showing you that the, the weapon is empty. Um, this has a very good set of sights on it. I don't know if you can see that at this point. Uh, I really like the sights on this weapon. They are adjustable. You don't see that on a lot of nine millimeters, but they're adjustable in the front and in the rear. Um, again, you know, like I said, this is a really, really solid weapon. A lot of nine millimeters don't feel this heavy, but this has a really, really solid feel to it. Okay, so we're ready to disassemble the weapon now. So what we're gonna do is we're going to return the slide home. Just let it go home there, let it come to a rest. And you're going to see a little indentation on the slide here around your takedown pin. Now, you know, this could be a little problematic. So what you're going to want to do, I like to hold it like this. And that way I can hold this slide back about three, four millimeters there. What you're wanting to do is get this indentation around the takedown pin lined up directly with it. If you'll put your thumb through the trigger well and pull that back, like I said, just a few millimeters, you'll very easily be able to position that, put your knife down in there, make sure you have it lined up correctly, and you're just going to use your knife to pop that bad boy out. So we'll take this little guy right here. Here's your takedown pin. We'll set him right over there. And then you're ready to take your weapon apart. Now, the weapon's off safer, it wouldn't come apart. And what you can do, just like any other pistol, you're gonna remove that. Now you have your frame, you have your slide rails, and uh, of course this one's nice and clean. I just cleaned it a couple weeks ago. Um, very, like I said, very fine weapon, very good shooting weapon, really, really enjoy it. And we're down here now to our fully assembled slide. Now, what you're gonna do, is you got that spring and pin assembly that's right up against in that latch as you can see at the bottom of the barrel assembly so what you want to do is use that that index finger pull that spring back get it off that latch and then you can pull it out now this one stays together and don't really come apart but you can clean it uh, just as easily remember you have the flat part the flush part that will go right back in here into that uh, bottom of the barrel assembly and then you have a part with a hole in it it's got a little little in, little nipple indentation on it that's going to seat right there at the end of the slide so what we're going to do now is just sit this little guy right over here and we can clean that if we want to if we need to and now what we have left in here is the barrel what i like to do is just use that middle finger Push up on that barrel, lift it right out of there. You can see it's kind of free floating now. What you can do, you can just grab that barrel, pull that barrel out, and have a good looking barrel there. It's a nice clean weapon. So our barrel's nice and clean. Like I said, I've cleaned this a couple of weeks back and uh, you know, like I said, really, really good shooting weapon. We'll go sit that little guy right over here. Now you have your completely disassembled slide aside from the firing pin. Um, uh, assembly here, which I, I know, I'm not going to get into taking that down. You could really mess up your firearm trying to do that on your own. Unless you really, really know what you're doing, um, I would uh, let a professional handle that if it needs to be taken down. Um, 
Again, if you need to clean this weapon, I recommend using a little hops number nine, uh, some Q-tips, a uh, wire bristle brush, and a soft bristle brush. That will take care of that thing. Of course, this one's nice and clean and lubricated right now. And, um, you know, everything looks really good in there. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and reassemble this weapon, and, and you're going to just do it in reverse order. So you're going to get your, your barrel assembly bag. You're going to put the barrel into the front of the slide, and you're just going to let it come sit back right at home there. It'll fall right down in there for you. Remember, you're going to take the open end of this pin, Remember, there's a flush end back here. There's one end with a hole. The end with the hole is going to go to the end of the slide below the barrel. And then you're going to sit right back down in there on that notch. It's going to sit right there for you, just like that. Now, what you can do, you're going to get this little guy back. You're going to get your slide rails lined up with the slide right here. Set that in there, push that thing forward. Of course, it's gonna come sit right back at home. Now, you will see the open hole right where that takedown pin goes back in, but remember, we've gotta get that thing back just a wee little bit, just a millimeter or two there, a few millimeters. Now, this takedown pin, if you'll look at that, there's a flat side and then there is a semicircle side little rounded side on top, flat on the bottom. The flat part goes down toward the trigger, the bottom of the weapon. You're gonna get that little guy back in there, wiggle it around a little bit, and just push it back in. See how it's in there? Now, we'll do a little functionality test on it. It's working real good. Just rack that a few times. Seems to be working well. We can go back, load it back up. Weapon on safe. At that point, go ahead and take the magazine back out, reload, and we're back ready to go weapon on safe. So that right there, folks, was the Ruger Security 9, newer uh, line of weapon from Ruger. A uh, very good shooting pistol, has uh, very good adjustable sights. On top, all together, feels really good. Highly recommend good shooting weapon. Uh, I'd like to thank everybody for uh, joining us uh, today to learn a little bit of how to take that weapon apart, put it back together. Um, you know, like and subscribe to Loot Press for more videos like this and uh, other good content. Again, thank you all for joining us today and you have a great day.